Hello beautiful people and welcome back to the Imperial Balloons channel where we strive to make you feel like royalty during all your special occasions. My name is Aisha and today I'm taking you guys along on this setup that I had to do and I feel like these are like very royal colors. We have a beautiful dark blue which is tough text navy blue and then we have a uh, simple text reflex gold and I don't know looking at these colors it just gives me a really royal queen king kingdom type of feel so i had a lot of fun doing this one it was actually a one hour setup um after talking to the client a little bit she asked me if it would be possible to do it within an hour because of what time she was able to get into the venue and i decided to give it a chance it was my first one ever and i feel like it went pretty well um, I was actually in and out within probably 45 minutes and the actual setting up of the balloons took about a half an hour that is excluding the time of putting the hoop together so just just putting the balloons on the hoop took me about 30 minutes roughly. I definitely did some extra preparations in order for me to be able to make this time because um, as you can see here I had already put some of the five inches on the cluster that I was going to put at the top um, and I had also tried to fill in the bottom just a little bit but I decided last minute not to blow up extra clusters at home because again I felt like it was a pretty small setup and it would be such a shame if I had blown up a whole bunch of clusters and then didn't have any use for them and I'm not one to de-inflate balloons I really do not like that task so <laughs> they would have probably just gotten popped and that is just you know a waste so yeah so now that the base is pretty much attached to the hoop I'm gonna start adding some filler and I'm not gonna try to do too much um, again I was in a bit of a time crunch and I also felt like I just didn't want to do too much with this setup sometimes a little bit goes a long way and that was kind of my motto when I went into this job now one thing that I would definitely change is the location of the two big 18 inch balloons because right now they're both facing front and they are sitting right below each other so that's something that I would definitely change. I would either, you know, move it a little bit to the left or the right or maybe remove one of them. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the only thing. And then I wasn't really happy with the location that I had to set up at, but that's what the client wanted. And it was pretty much the only space in the venue that uh, didn't have something else behind on the wall that you would see because the hoop, of course, it's, it's empty in the middle. So this was the best of kind of the worst <laughs> options that I could set up at but yeah the client liked it she loved it so that's all that matters at the end of the day At this point, I'm almost pretty much done with this setup. I'm just adding my five inches. Again, keep calling them five inches, but they are three inches. So now I'm just gonna start finishing up with adding my three inches. And then 
um, I had a weight at the bottom of the balloon hoop so I'm gonna cover that with um, the table runner that I have under it I don't think you're gonna see that in this video but it'll definitely be in the end result but yeah that's pretty much it for this video it's a short one thank you guys again for watching and you can subscribe to the channel leave a like or share a video with a friend and you can find me on all social media platforms at imperialballoons.ac Thank you guys again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.